I've just recorded a review for the 3M privacy filter for the Microsoft Surface Book. It will follow this. However, I've only just looked at the price. This is just shy of £40. £40 for a piece of plastic that just happens to be the right shape with a couple of their, you know, 3M command stickies. I'm afraid in the following review I say 3 out of 5. I'm going to have to say I don't like it. 2 out of 5. Crazy. Hello! We've got another item to review. It's a screen protector. That's not the bad bit. The bad bit is it's for the Surface Book. So I have this set up over here, but we're going to open this first and have a look at it. So what we've got is a, well, you see, it's, this is quite a large thing. It's much larger than the size of the Surface Book, but we'll see. Um, it's it's okay, the packaging. It could be bent. It's only, you know, two bits of uh, cardboard. Um, we've got a fob top opener. Let's see if we can... I see, okay, it's a security opener so that you can only open it for once and it all unpeels. Okay, there we go. And uh, yeah, so there's another piece of card protecting it on the inside. So it's three pieces of card for the packaging to keep this thing straight. Um, uh, just don't see any sticky at the moment. So, the instructions. There they are. Sticky. We shall have a look. So, uh, yeah, not obvious, but they're all there. Let's just have a quick peek at the instructions because they're on the floor. Uh, quite a large instruction manual. We got important read all instructions before applying. Before applying the adhesive to filter, select the side of the filter with laser etched product number facing you, the viewing side. Okay. Determine where to place the attachment strips depending on your device. We'll look at that in a second. Here's the filter. Now the question is, so you can actually already see. You can see me? They can't. You can see me? They can't. That's basically how they work. They're just smacking the polarized polarization. Um, it's in a sealed bag. I don't have a pair of scissors. So I will open it by tearing it a little bit, and then I'll try and get it because I don't want to put a fold in it. Of course, it doesn't work way out. There we go. Okay, so it is that is quite a um, useful thing. So where's this product number? It's a product number facing you, and there's definitely no product number. Product number 407. I'm going to presume that there's meant to be a notch, or something, but there is a notch. But Okay, guys, so here is. Let me just move my light, otherwise, you can't see anything, can you guys? There we go. Uh, and the light is gone. So you can see it isn't attached, this is just placed in. So you can see. The cutout misses the top. It's actually missing the two little felt pads as well, which is quite nice. Um, but if there's absolutely any flex on this, it really gives you a strange double image. I don't, can you see? see this double imaging? If there's the tiniest, tiniest gap at all, you can see this double image now. The touch screen still works with it, but this looks so weird. Okay, so there's the privacy mode or privacy. It's how you're meant to see it, so you can't see what's on the screen. But you still can. You know. Okay, it's dim, but you can still see through the filter. You just get this doubling effect. It's almost uh, like a hologram. Now, I don't want to attach this at the moment. I want to check whether this is normal because it's really, really. I mean, 
that is flat okay I'm holding that flat I'm holding that flat you can see I've got fingers holding it in this corner and down here I can see you can't see see the do you see the white there is definitely I'm holding that I'm really holding it above and below the white you can you can hold on there like that look and I can still see a double, a double effect. It's really obvious when there's a gap. See, this is I'm pushing that on now. In fact, we can go one step further because, of course, this is the surface board. We can turn it around, put it down flat, and we can we can press this down. it's really obvious when it's white it's not so obvious on a color at all so pressing this on and in place I'm definitely seeing a double let's turn it over and see if it's something to do. oh it's darker that way around it works either way but it's, it's definitely getting this double edge so you can't see you can still see through that privacy filter, you can still see through it. I don't care what they say. Um, it works better standing on its own. Yeah. So you can't see through it. You can. You you know you, you can and can't. But when there's light behind it, you can still see through that. Look, you can still see that shape. I can see it now on the camera. It may be indistinct. You can still going to be the best stickies in the world. But would I want to put sticky on this just for this? Probably not. They do actually fit in the margins of the screen. Um, they fit fine in the margins. But yeah not going to be doing that I'm not going to be using it don't think it's absolutely effective I'm gonna probably give this it has a fault on the manual it isn't perfect on this it's it's only if you're really paranoid and there is still this ghosting effect I mean it may even be a three out of five folks a three out of five